thank you for coming back to my channel for your stimulus check and stimulus package update please subscribe to my channel please leave your thumbs up and please leave your comments first of all i want to say thank you so much for all the support that you give me on this channel i really do appreciate you for that thank you so much bitcoin i'm getting where i'm i'm about ready to quit saying this because uh it looks like it's dying out but i'm going to say it this time bitcoin whatsapp any type of cryptocurrency if you see it in my comments with my name and my picture please just pay it no never mind it is fake it is a scammer it is not me it has slowed way down and i hadn't seen any on my site in a while now so i'll probably quit saying that now y'all we the people website if you want your comments put over on the, the we the people website please start it by saying we the people so we can see it also uh the we the people uh facebook group we, we got a giveaway going over there now uh it is a very nice prize uh i'll just have to tell y'all to check it out uh and it won't be long we'll be giving that away i i would if i had to guess i would say two weeks maybe three weeks tops we'll be giving that away and then when we get that one gave away we got 10 more of them we're going to give away so y'all be sure and check out that facebook group uh, the link is in the description box below you have to answer one question to get in okay let's get into this senator joe manson wants to press the pause button Y'all, Senator Joe Manchin is a piece of work. Uh, I mean, how long has the pause button been on now? I mean, nothing is getting done. The only thing that's getting done is vacation time. Uh, when they come back from vacation, guess what? They're only going to be there for a few days, and they're going back on vacation again. But this uh, $3.5 trillion package, the family care plan, the human infrastructure, whatever you want to call it this week, uh, he wants to push the pause button on it. And the reason for this is he says he don't know what's going to happen now since the Delta variance is showing up, uh, also the stuff that's going on in Afghanistan. So he wants to pr press the pause button on kind of these two things. Well, while he presses the pause button, the American people are still suffering. The American people are still getting kicked out of their homes. The American people are still losing everything they've got. The American people are suffering. They can't pay their groceries. They can't pay their rent. They can't buy their medications. But he's fine with pressing the pause button even longer. We need all 50 senators in the House to get this passed. If only one of them says no, it don't get passed. It is crazy. It should be the majority rules thing. Y'all, please remember, while they're fighting, arguing back and forth, pressing their pause button, going on vacation, the American people are still suffering. And Joe Manson says no he wants to press the pause button i wish we could press the pause button on joe manson's paycheck until he does the job that he's been hired to do now i can bet you anything and you mark my word this is going to happen now that he said let's press the pause button Christian Cinema is going to do the same thing. She's going to follow his lead. Y'all, if we don't get all 50 of these senators that's in the House on board with this thing, we get nothing. We will not get the first infrastructure bill passed, which is fine with me. If they don't pass the human infrastructure, I don't want them to pass the first one we will not get the human infrastructure bill passed the human infrastructure i call it the american families plan because that's what they first started calling it so if we don't if he says let's push the pause button and he votes no he don't vote the american people will just be left out in the cold again 
because a few lawmakers don't get their way. They act like a bunch of babies. If they don't get their way, they sit and pout. Y'all, please, I am begging you. In the midterm elections, remember this. It's time we clean house and get these scumbags out of office. And then in 2024, we need to clean house again and finish the job. Y'all, if we don't, if we keep voting these same people in office, we only have ourselves to blame. I mean, you can't keep doing the same thing and expect a different result. We have to vote them out of office because they simply do not care. They've proved it time and time again. The American people are hurting. The American people are losing their homes. They're losing everything they've ever worked for. They're losing their health because they can't afford good food. I had a lady this morning in the comments. I won't call her name. She says she gets $19 in food stamps. And everybody wonders why everybody's health is failing because $19 don't buy healthy food. Have you ever noticed the price of healthy food is three times as much as unhealthy food. And they think $19 worth of food stamp is going to get healthy food. Well, that's the reason the American people's health is failing. Because they eat junk food. Because they can't afford the good stuff. And $19, what is that going to get? Come on. And then they're going to raise the SNAP benefits. I, it's on my morning video. I think it's something like... Uh, $36 or something like that a month average. What is that going to buy? They're giving us little crumbs that don't amount to nothing. We don't need crumbs. We need the whole slice of bread. These lawmakers don't care because they eat high on the hog every day. They don't know what it's like to be an average American citizen. They'll never know that. Because even if they're all voted out of office today and their career is completely shot, they've got enough to live on, comfortable, the rest of their lives. So we don't need to worry about them. We need to get them out of office. They're taken care of for the rest of their life. And we're not taken care of until tomorrow. There's people out here that don't know where their next meal is coming from. There's people out here that don't know, well, will I be evicted today? They dread getting up in the morning because they don't know what that day brings them. And our lawmakers simply do not care. We have to show them in the midterms and in the 24 election that we simply don't care about them and vote them all out of office. Joe Manson has always been a thorn in the side of the American people. Along with Nancy Pelosi has always been a thorn. The mooch man McConnell has always been a thorn. I mean, we need to get these people out of office. Chuck Schumer needs to go. Uh, Joe Biden needs to go. Every one of them that's in office right now, I don't care who they are. Even if you think they're doing good, they need to go. Because... What have they done to prevent this? They didn't fight hard enough to prevent this. Every time they have a vote for a bill, they end up folding. They end up going with the status quo. I mean, they talk a big game that they want stimulus checks for the American people. But then when it comes time to vote, they say, let's push the pause button. Y'all, in the comments below, tell me if there's one thing that you think we will get in this next bill, what would it be? Do you think Joe Manson will hold out? Do you think he will press the pause button? These are just two questions I'd like to know what you feel about. Y'all, if you want your comments put over on the We The People website, please start it by saying We The People. We will take it over there for you. Please check out that website. We 
post a blog on there twice a week and there's going to be some big changes coming to that website and I uh, hope you will like it so be sure and check out the website if you want to join the Facebook group uh, you, the link is in the description box below you just have to answer that one yes or no question also we're given we having a giveaway over on the Facebook group real soon it's a very nice giveaway uh, we ordered 12 of these things I'm keeping one for myself they're very nice y'all join up in the Facebook group you'll have a chance of winning it's very simple to win I love you all keep your faith in Jesus Christ say a prayer for our country say a prayer for our world say a prayer for our leaders whether you like them or not say a prayer for everyone that's hurting through COVID financial hardship or any other affliction I love you all please say a special prayer for the people that's facing eviction and the lack of food on their dinner table I love you all. Ciao.